One last time. Is it MK Dons? One last moment. Can we make the turnaround? Hello, this is Luca AFC here, and today I'm back here with another match day vlog, another match day experience, second leg semi final of the League Two playoff. MK Dons home to Corny Town. Of course, I was at the game on Tuesday. Very, very disappointed game on Tuesday, of course. Of course, Crawley now take the second leg, a 3-0 lead. That was a very disappointing performance. Very, very, very poor performance. And, of course, it just wasn't good enough. I said it in my match day vlog. And funny enough about the vlog is, is that YouTube decided to take my vlog down, which I was very disappointed and very angry about. Maybe because I got a little bit anger on the vlog. Maybe because it was on Sky Rights. But tonight the game is on Sky and hopefully my vlog does not get taken down because tonight, you never know, we could be a good one. But today, look, we saw Doncaster getting knocked down. I didn't watch the Doncaster game, but I saw the goals and who expected Crew Alexander to knock out Doncaster? So, um, look, I'm going to have a little bit of hope, but I'm not sure if we're going to supreme and get what, get what we want, but... Can we pull the miracle? You've seen Doncaster took a 2-0 lead to Crew. Look what happened. Crew went to Don Crew went to Doncaster. Doncaster lost in their own backyard. So um do I really give a score prediction? I think Dons are gonna win 2-0, but I can't see us happening. But come on, Luca AFC. You're the vlogger. You need to show a bit of faith. We're gonna do this. And I'll see you down at the game tonight, up the franchise. So we've arrived at Stadium of MK. Big, big, big game today. Of course, you can see all the MK Dons lads out today. Like I said, look, are we going to be doing the miracle? You saw Doncaster got knocked out yesterday against Crew Alexander. Um, strange things have happened. Look, if we can get an early goal in the first few minutes, Anything's possible, and uh, the weather is lovely. Big atmosphere tonight. Got in, and I'm really looking forward to the game, whatever happens. And um, we're gonna do this, man. We're gonna do this. I'm here, I'm up here, the upper tier's open. We're gonna do this. 3 0 MK Dons, penalties, five free settings, pitch invasion, and I'll see you at the end of the game. So I've just seen the MK Dons line up at the moment. What the hell is this lineup really? Like, Kelly has been dropped in a game like this. You're dropping Kelly. Look, of course, we're 3 0 down at the moment against Corny, but you've got to have a bit of hope. And of course, you're playing Philip Marshall in goal. Tucker retains his place. Stephen Wen retains his place. I'm thinking it's a similar lineup what we played. And look, of course, we knew that Williamson was going to go with a similar lineup. But to drop Michael Kelly in a game like this, especially at home in front of like near enough a sellout, I'm thinking, mate, I'm still gonna be optimistic, man. I've come all the way up here and I'm gonna be optimistic. And I'm not happy with the lineup, but to see people like Tucker and Wen starting, I just really don't get it. Like, that's kind of like knocked a lot of people's confidence down, but. You never know, mate. Anything can happen. We'll see what happens. Mate, I'll tell you what, you can see the atmosphere in this stadium. It's unbelievable for a semi-final League 2. Having that hope, if you can make a dramatic comeback, like 3-0 down and you're making that dramatic comeback, and literally the atmosphere you can see in this stadium over here is unbelievable, mate. And that's what you want to see. You want to see atmosphere like this, especially when it's a big, massive game. Thank you. 
Ah, uh, shit. Not a good start. Is this sort of like Tuesday all over again? Like going 1 0 down and now they're 4 0 up on aggregate. Now we have got to get four. It's not looking good at the moment, but we're not giving up. The atmosphere is helping us. We're all going to get behind that 12th men. But Crawley's going in the first, second minute, like they did on Tuesday when they scored in the fifth minute. It's not looking good at the moment, man. And you just don't want to concede first when you're 3 0 down in the first leg. It's not looking good. We need to move very, very, very quicker. This isn't looking very good at the moment. It's, this is kind of reminding me a little bit of Tuesday, but I'm not giving up my faith yet. I know we need to score four goals, but anything is possible. Maybe, look, if Crawley get another one, maybe you can say it's done. But I'm not giving up just right yet at the moment. I still believe we can get four goals. Call me delusional or whatever, but I still believe we can get something out of this game. But... We need to start very, very quick because it's similar to the performance on Tuesday. Woo! What a chance for Thompson. Takes the shot and it goes wide. But we've got a caller at the moment. But the trouble is, it's our first shot on target. But I don't know if I've got any hope. But let's see what happens. <laughs> That's it. That's it. That's it. We're done. It's done and dusted. It's done, mate. 2 0. Crawley. Tucker and Harvey, you need to leave this football club. These players are not good enough anymore. I'm sorry, but this is the same kind of performance we saw on Tuesday. 5-0 on aggregate. We have to score five. It's done. It's done. It's done. It's done. It's done. It's done. Two nil down. Daniel Harvey, you are absolutely garbage. You shouldn't not be here anymore. You and the rest of these players need to be sold in the summer. Two nil down in a game like this. And us fans, I come here every single week to vlog and put everything out. 2 nil down, and we see the same kind of performance on Tuesday. Done, mate. Chill out and relax. Mate, our fans, right, in the cow shed are chanting, Pete Winkleman, sell the club, sell the club, sell the club. Mate, he ain't going anywhere anytime soon. Like, people are talking about, oh yeah, get Red Bull in, get another investor in, that's gonna sort his football club. A premiership stadium that only fills up when half of the day trip has come, come, right, it only fills out when we actually need them. Even when you have a big team coming down or a playoff game, right? Pete is not going to sell this football club. And, it, and look, we all want him to go, but at the same time, he ain't going anywhere. But a lot of changes needs to be made in the summer. Like literally, this squad, people were talking about one of MK Dons, one of the favorite squads to potentially go up automatic but of course what's really let us that let us down this season which is probably been a bit, not really a good towards the end of the season is our away form losing to teams like Bradford away Grinsby away drawing to Knox County losing to stupidity teams where we should be end up picking up points and that's what really cost us and in the away form MK Dons were sitting in 14th place and that's what really, really cost us. And then it put us into this position. It's put us into the playoffs. And we don't do very well in the playoffs. And that's what's really, really, like, put us really down. But a lot of changes have got to be made. A lot of players are going to be sold. Reports that Willington could be going to Barnsley. Then that, then that means we'd have to get a new manager. It's all messed up. And this is why we've got to sort this out in the summer. We've got to regroup again next season. And we've got to get back into League One, push it for the, for the following year. Four one 
Crawley right now. I'm speechless. I don't know what to say, mate. Like, today is an absolutely embarrassing. Like, these players for me are not fit to wear the shirt. And a lot of changes needs to be sorted in the summer. Williamson, I can't see him being here next season, especially when clubs are looking at him like Championship and League One clubs are looking at him as well. These players, a lot of players are on free contracts in the summer. Ten players are on contracts. Like, it's not looking good at the moment, and what are we supposed to do? It's, it's just embarrassing. Mate, full time in the car. MK Dons won five Crawley, eight one on aggregate. The biggest aggregate in record history in Sky Bet League Two. I don't know what to say, people, but that is an absolutely embarrassing. This is, uh, uh, mate, as an MK Dons fan, right, as my second club, I feel embarrassed. I feel really, really embarrassed to do this, but at the end of the day, right, these players are not fit to wear the shirt. And for me, a lot of things need to, need, need to be done in the summer because the recruitment has been very bad. Um, Liam Sweeten hasn't done anything. Pete needs to take a lot of responsibility on this. We've had a lot of players who have been on loan, like the likes of Jack Payne and Lewis Bay. All these players are going to be going back. We've got 10 players going uh, out of contract. What's the future with Dean Lewington? Is he going to play one more year in this League 2? It's just pathetic. It's just absolutely embarrassing for this football club. Just, just like to, over the two legs to lose eight goals. It's embarrassing. And, and, and look... Where do we go from here for next season? Like, the whole team needs, the whole recruitment, the club is just, just in a complete state again. Another season in League Two. Like, stupidity, what teams have actually cost us and what's actually cost us is our way for. 14th in the informed table, 14th in the away form table is absolutely embarrassing. Losing to teams where we should be beating, drawing to Notts County. Grinsby losing, Bradford losing, drawing to Newport, drawing to Warsaw. I don't know what to say, but I'm going to end the video from here. And I want to say thank you very much. And I know it hasn't ended very well, but I want to say thank you very much. And I want to big up to a Don's fan called Logan as well, who's actually been watching my um, channels. And uh, I want to say thank you for everyone who has supported the channel. And I'll see you... Perhaps I might see you next season, I might not see you next season, but can we have at least, never mind about the likes, but can we have at least 50 likes on the video and I'll see you very soon, bye for now.